Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Carlo Cicchetto. I'm Marcella Lee. You know it is Chopper 8. The helicopter used by us here at News 8 was left badly damaged and on its side after a rough landing at Gillespie Field. Thankfully, no one was seriously hurt this afternoon. It happened just after the helicopter was returning from covering a story. Our Monique Griego has an update live from El Cajon. Monique. After the helicopter made that hard landing and crashed on its side, the first thing was to make sure that everyone was okay. We're told one person was sent to the hospital with minor injuries. After that, the next major concern was all the fuel that spilled on the runway. They had to get that cleaned up to prevent any major fires. News 8 rushed to the scene after hearing Chopper 8 was down and one person had been taken to the hospital. In the video, you can see the helicopter is on the runway but flipped on its side. Its tail is broken off and there's debris scattered around it. We're told the aircraft has significant damage and there was a small fire, but it was quickly put out by firefighters. Again, while there were two people on board, no one suffered any major injuries. One witness told News 8 she saw the pilot up and walking, so it's assumed the passenger was the one taken to the hospital to be checked out. The witness said sent us this cell phone video of the aftermath. There's a video of the News 8 chopper chop that just crashed over in El Cajon. I guess the pilot's okay. No serious injuries, but boy, it looks like a horrible crash. Praise God, everybody's alive. Now, with the aircraft hauled away from the scene, it will be up to the NTSB to investigate what caused the helicopter to flip and crash on its side. And again, just a very scary situation. Anytime an aircraft goes down like this or crashes here at Gillespie Field, but again, everyone is expected to be okay. Back to you. All right, and to clarify, Chopper 8 is branded with the News 8 logo on its sides and is operated, though, by a third party. Its video feeds are shared by multiple media outlets here in San Diego. While the people on board the Chopper are not employees of KFMB, we do work with them very closely and consider them to be friends. And our thoughts are with them tonight.